debate is very important debate because we don't come here to say that this is what we are going to do. We come here to uh, meet with the parliamentarians to let them know what we think and to listen to them because they themselves, they have some ideas, they have some preoccupations and they have some orientations that they can give to us. And when we put it together, this will enable us when we will come to prepare the budget. So there is a, there is a slight difference between this debate and the discussion we used to have in November, December. This is the first thing. The second thing is just what I told them, that the situation is that we are experiencing our economy, that our economy is resilient. This is the truth. But when we see what's going on in the war in, in Eastern Europe, and this pandemic that has not, uh, uh, has not gone away, we think that we have to be very, very, very cautious because we are optimistic. But things can change if this war continues, if the, if the insecurity we are facing remains. And uh, this is why we have to have an internal effort that we have to do so as to try to close the gap, the gap that can exist between the forecast we have and the reality that we can we can experience afterwards. And Mr. Minister, how do you solve the question you raised on the subsidies which are increasing and the other expenditures we have to cut off? Yes, it's a problem. It's a problem. Even, even our partners have made a statement about that. But you know, the problem is that we have to find a solution. Because I can't, the government can say, can't say that now I am going to increase the price like that. We know all what can happen. And if it happens, those people who say you don't have to do this, they will disappear. They will not be there to solve the problem. But the problem is there. And since the problem is there, we have to look for the solutions. And this is what we are doing. There are some ways and we are trying to see what can be the best solution for that.